Buying a home is always a big decision. It is. Mm -hmm. And the median cost of a house these days is, and much of the triangle is really over $400,000. So it's now a costly one to a CBS 17's Harrison Grubb is live for us tonight in Raleigh. And Harrison, what does the market look like these days? Well, the market has actually remained pretty consistent and surprisingly, to, compared to this time last year, house prices have actually dipped a little bit. As more people consider relocating to the Triangle, availability continues to be a challenge. We, we still have low inventory, but we've had that for a long time. According to the most recent data from the Triangle Multiple Listing Service, there were just over 3,700 new listings last month across the Triangle, a nearly 23% decrease from last April. But it's a good time to sell and buy, mostly because while interest rates seem high, they're very normal historically. There is no 2.5% anymore. That's not happening. However, because of the low inventory, it's a really good time to sell. Despite the low inventory, prices have dipped slightly since this time last year. Wake County's median sales price in April was around $472,000, down from $485,000. The entire region was at $400,000, and experts say you can get something for less. You can definitely find it. I have multiple clients who have found homes under $400,000. New developments outside of Raleigh also looking to bring lower costs. In Clayton, construction of single-family housing starting just below $290,000 is underway, and the region's median sales price remains below the national average. New data from the U.S. Census Bureau released today shows the national median around 420,000, the lowest since December 2021. Kendall Clark, a broker at Raleigh Realty, says home buying habits have also changed, with homes sitting on the market longer. Buyers are thinking about things because it's more of a decision than it was when your interest rate was next to nothing. And she says that sellers will now have to be a little bit more competitive with their pricing and also be prepared to make a little bit more concessions in order to have their houses come off the markets sooner. In Raleigh, Harrison Grubb, CBS 17 News. All right, Harrison, thank you.